Hey, hey everybody, it's Miranda from Diamond Painting with the Besties. How are you tonight? So it's Wednesday, March 31st, happy hump day. We are almost through the week. So what I have today, ooh, with my address showing and everything, hopefully you didn't see that, is an unboxing. A little disclaimer, the dogs are settling in so you might hear them walking around. Um, other than that, it's pretty quiet here. So let's get into this. This is a new company to me. I saw Mindy doing an unboxing on this um, a while back. And so I watched because I'd never heard of this company. This is Radiant Round DIY. And you know, um, I had gotten like a crystal canvas before, so I'm trying to get a couple more. So this one is um, supposed to be all crystals. So I apologize. I have had this for a very long time and I'm just now getting around to um, unboxing it for you guys. So a few stats. I ordered this on the 12th of February. It was $30. There was no tax and free shipping. So out the door, it was $30. Get this. Guess when I this was delivered to my house. It was delivered on the 16th, four days. So the um, company, they ship from Massachusetts. So that's why I got it so quickly. So it was definitely a pleasant surprise. Another thing that I really liked is that um, they're all set sizes. So I didn't have to mess around and go back and forth because I'm super indecisive. So I wasn't sure like, do I want this size or that size? It's a, this is a 50 by 60 centimeter. So $30 for, a, you know, 50 by 60 to me is pretty good. So let's get into this. Probably should have opened it beforehand, but they didn't, they did. I'm probably opening, oh, and I'm over here opening up the, uh, harder side of the box, of course. There we go, this is a lot easier. So um, it's a basic, basic uh, box. I have it upside down, but here we go. It's just a basic DIY box that some of the other companies come in. We'll pull this out. All right, make sure there's nothing else in here. So our packaging slip it comes on pretty purple paper. It says, thank you, Heather, from Radiant Round DIY. And it just has my um, canvas that I ordered. So this is poured glue. So let's, uh, I'll have, I'm gonna re-roll it, let's get all of our stuff out. And let me re-roll this real quick. If I, if I can, good gravy. It's been in the box for a while. So it's a pretty stiff canvas, sturdy canvas. And we know we can roll this the other way because it is poured glue and I'm probably doing like a horrible job at it, but we'll just give it a second. Maybe it'll lay a little bit flatter. All right, well, I'll hold on to this. So. Sorry that took so long. So we have a basic kit. We have a small white boat with a funnel. There's a uh, six placer, a pad of wax, and your basic, your basic pen in here. All right, they give you a schematic. There is 30 colors. They do have the DMC on there. The legend is small. The legend is very small to see what the symbols are. But at least it came with an inventory. So it has the DMC code and how many you're supposed to have and how many bags of each you get. Here are our crystals. We'll get into that a little bit later. So, um, I don't, here is our beautiful image. 
So normally I am not into the traditional African art, but I thought this was kind of a uh, cross uh, between it because um, it has her beautiful hair being flipped. I'm assuming it's supposed to look like the continent of Africa. We have our birds over here and we have a giraffe and a tree and her beautiful face right here and her bandeau wrap and her gold arm wrap. So we do have two schematics and two thumbnails. So in the bottom left, we have our schematic and our thumbnail. And then in the upper right, so this is the first canvas I've had where I've got two thumbnails. Um, it says diamond painting at the top. The canvas is not branded. So let's try and see if this will get to lay a little bit flatter. So with poured glue, you know, you can pull it back, but just be careful, don't pull it back the entire way. And then can slowly, there's a lot of static, slowly, you know, bring it back down. To get it to lay down, hopefully a little flatter. And if that doesn't work, then you can always turn it the other way. What, oh, there's a big bubble. Turn it the other way and lay some... Some like I put some heavy books on top of it. So while I'm here, I'm gonna peep the symbols. Now, um, already I'm seeing that on the light symbols, there are dark lettering, but on the dark symbols, there's also dark lettering. So I really hope with my light pad, I can see that. So the symbols are clear, but I, I'm not quite sure how they're going to look on the darker symbols. And from here, I'm gonna try and show you. From here though, it is look, looking like the dark spots are slightly pixelated. Oh, is there air? Oh. No, it's just because there's a little, there's a wrinkle. So let's, let me try and take a look. So from far away, it doesn't look like it. But when you get up close, the birds, sorry for the glare, they look pixelated, kind of the giraffe. All the dark areas look very muddled. The rendering on her face looks good, but her lips look blurry to me, like the actual shape. And I'm trying not to get that glare, you guys. Um, here is fine, but we'll see about the bracelet and everything. So I'm kind of worried about that. Like I said, it's a 50 by 60. There, This is a glitter canvas. There is glitter throughout. So let's flip this over. And um, I knew I thought I had a tape measure. I literally just saw that's like the one thing I'm constantly, here it is. All right. Finally, I remembered to place my tape measure. Sorry, guys. So let's see if this is true to size. So. It is on the money for 60 And it's actually a tick over 50. So that's cool, it is true to size, plus some. All right, let's, uh... so this is my second full canvas, full um, rhinestone canvas. I do love that they come already bagged up for me. I'm not like Brad, Brad loves to kit up and I'm like, eh. If I have to pick and choose, I'm gonna take it already uh, ready to go. There is right here the kit number. 
So in case you store them separately, I only store it separately if I can't get it back in the bag originally. And that's why I don't always like taking them out, but I'm just gonna take a few of them out so we can see. So of course we have our trusty 310. And these look, I think it's a mixture actually, because there's not, it's not full crystal because this right here is, it's got the silver backs, but it looks just like regular 310 to me. Like they're not like crystals. Or rhinestones but let's look at another color because I see a mixture in here so right here this 818 that you can see is like sorry for the glare guys is super spark like a sparkly so that's definitely crystals but there's a lot of like dark colors in here mostly like browns and here we go, let's see, pull this one out. The citron color is really nice, like this gold. But lots of browns and golds and everything. Um, I'll, be, I'll take inventory later. Oh, here, uh, 321 is uh, this dark, this red right here. So they all look good. I'll have to see more how it gets in. Oh, I didn't do the sticky test either. Let's see. So put this back over, see if I can get this somewhat like it was when I got it. Oh, I think I'm gonna do it. Yeah, I got it. I got those nice and tight. All right. Um, what did I say I was gonna do? I just forgot. Alrighty, um, yeah, the symbol, I'm really, really hope that this is, comes out really pretty because I think it's like an awesome image. I'm just very worried about um, being able to see the symbols right here in the bottom part of her hair, her bandeau top, uh, the birds, um, maybe it's just like that because of the different uh, things, just the different, now it's weird because there are, Okay, there are guide circles on here, but they are very, very faint. So I don't think that's going to be an issue, especially in the dark areas. I don't know, hopefully it just won't show through or anything. Let's see if there's some cr any crazy symbols. Um, they are kind of small in the legend, but not as small on your uh, inventory sheet. So... There's nothing simil similar that I see. And it's a mixture of letters and symbols. Excuse me, no numbers. So hopefully I can get to this soon. I know there's a lot of events going on and everything, but to, oh, I know. See, if I just talk about something else. So the, the kit number and let's see, is it on here? So the kit, the number of the drills, there's nothing on the kit indicating what the number canvas this is. So I'm just gonna have to make sure that I can get it back in the box, good to go. Um, I'm definitely will have to let this rest before I work on it and everything, bless you Zeus. Um, yeah, so anywho, four days to get here is great. That's a plus. Um, it's a beautiful image, and I hope that it comes out. Um, like I said, I'm a little worried about the rendering. Um, $30 out the door, 50 by 60, and the name is Beautiful African Woman. Um, their site does not have a ton. Their uh, crystal canvases have like 41. They're full, ra the rounds, there's like 50 something, but then they have like a, um, a few accessories, some storage options. What else? Um, other tiny little projects like masks and like the little um, storage box containers and things like that. Like the, um, you know, the cloth ones that stand up that you can paint on the front. 
and things like that. So there isn't a ton, which can be a positive or a negative. Um, some of the other sites have way too many, but then this one, you know, it's a decent amount. And I just skimmed through, but basically they're, Images are the basic stock images that you guys see all the time throughout all the other, you know, you know, budget sites and what have you like that. So, like I said, I will put all the information down in the bottom for you guys to check out the website and everything. So, I hope you guys have a great day and I'll talk to you later. Take care. Bye. <laughs>